thought I'd take the old soft top out for a run. Got the soft top half undone. Got no brakes, no gear stick. Let's go. people know this was the um race spec suzuki sierra so this is actually the race spec suzuki sierra now she flexes like a dead giraffe just on the edge there i reckon i could push her over like this so on the race spec suzuki we don't have a bull bar or a bumper bar because we get that mint approach angle so we've got massive 37s on this girl doesn't look like it because she's sitting so high on the lift underneath we've got a mint exhaust that's fallen off, so we can hear that engine purr. Now get ready, because under this bonnet is an engine that could beat all your 1,000 horsepower stock Supras. Yeah, you got that right. This is a 9.7 litre V8. Now actually what they did with the V8, they had to chop it in half. Weight saving, you see? This thing had so much power, the whole chassis twisted when it took off. The stock engine mounts aren't strong enough to hold all the power of this engine. So we've got some nice 8 gauge fencing wire here holding the whole engine in the car. Now you don't need any of those AN braided fuel lines. When you use these stock rubber ones, it saves so much weight and you'll get so much more fuel through them. So this engine sucks in so much air, this air filter's gotta be replaced all the time because it sucks so much dirt in. Now there ain't no carpet in this race spec Suzuki because you wanna be able to hear every little rattle it's making. When starting this car, the fuel pump can't get nearly enough fuel into the engine to start it. So you've got an old tomato sauce bottle here, pour that down the throat of it, and she'll start right up. Now as you can see, there's a roll cage in this race spec Suzuki. Don't know why they put that there when you're just going to fall right out the roof. So as you can see, there's no fancy spoiler on this race spec Suzuki. All you've got to do for all your downforce is just pop your sun visors up. As you can see, there's been so much force on it, holding the car down while racing, it's fallen off. But that's all you need to do, just pop those up, and you'll have every bit of downforce you want. So when you're at like 240k an hour in this race spec Suzuki, you come down here, you press the first red button, and that'll get you up to 302 seconds. Then when you're up to 300, you come down and you press the second nitrous button, 400, like that. Now let's take this race spec Suzuki and see what it can do. So as you can see, the race spec Suzuki has got a lot of flex, something you patrol owners won't know much about. So we've got to take this thing back to the shed now, only because our headlights, we took the globes out, and um, we don't have any light. 